Hey everyone and welcome to Amala Popcorn. I'm Stephanie. Thank you for clicking on this video. Now if you're someone who enjoys talking about film, then consider hitting that subscribe button. So today we're going to be talking about A24's newest film, The Green Knight. <laughs> Now, like I said, it is an A24 film, and I do quite enjoy A24 movies. Um, one of my favorites is probably Midsommar. I really, really enjoyed that one. The Greenhouse, not the Greenhouse, <laughs> the Lighthouse. I do really want to rank the A24 movies, but they do have a lot of a lot of horror movies. Again, yeah, no, I'm not about that life. I may just eventually, well, like when Lamb comes out later on in the year, I might just end up ranking the ones that I have seen, which is not horror movies, but we'll get to that when we get to it. Now, the Green Knight starting Death Patel. Holy moly, you guys. Wow, this is a heck of a movie. Yeah, no, I don't get technical here, you guys. It's, well, it's very rare. I, I really don't. If you're new here, I if you're looking for technicality, if you're looking for structure, that's not here. That, that We don't do that here. Oh, I'm leaving my glasses on, so I just got to deal with the ring light. I want to look at you today. We're going to get a little bit technical here, you guys, because this movie is absolutely visually stunning to look at. Oh my god, the shots. We have a lot of wide shots going on here, and it is just... Mm, you guys, it is just gorgeous to look at. We have a lot of scenery. We're within the time period of like King Arthur, the round table, the knights type of film here. But it's not your typical type of knights tell. We're not fighting. We're more, think of it more as a quest. But we're on this quest for like honor it does take some time to get there you guys it is a long movie it's a little over two hours long and i already know that this movie is not gonna be for everybody it's it's really not because of the length because there's no real big excitement action sequence fighting to it we get a lot of those really cool not, i mean we have those wide shots but then we get like these really really intimate like close-up shots I mean, like, everything about it is great. The director, you guys, actually... Because this movie was supposed to come out last year. But, of course, because of COVID, it got delayed. Which ended up being a good thing because I did read that the director wasn't happy with the cut that he originally was going to release at South by Southwest. COVID hit, he kind of put it aside, he forgot about it. And then, you know, time came up again and he tackled the movie again with fresh eyes more calm more relaxed and ended up doing uh, quite a few edits he actually ended up adding a couple more scenes and changing up some things and just to think that if it wasn't because of covid we would have got something that this review could have been totally different totally different it's 824 you guys so you know you're gonna get some sort of like twisty weird like out there kind of thing it is based off of a poem the green knight i personally have not read it and that last bit you guys i, I feel like i could talk about this movie a lot but we're, we're gonna try to keep this sh we're not gonna keep this very short but <laughs> as short as i can keep it because yeah i'm gonna wrap it up you guys i'm gonna wrap it up because i don't i i, I fear if i keep mm, i'm going to tell you guys stuff and i really don't want to do it the ending you guys literally like all the emotions i was just like what mm, we got <laughs> we got a lot going on you guys we we got some some like witches we got knights i mean we got a quest we got some weird i don't even know this other thing like i don't know there's like this cga fox that i'm not too sure about like I like him but then it kind of brings me out of the movie that makes sense because it, it feels like it doesn't belong we have this Groot's grandpa <laughs> Groot's great grandpa I don't know I don't know we got giants there's just like a lot but it works in its own way and if this is something that seems at all interesting to you I highly recommend for you to check it out I think it's just absolutely beautiful. It's a great story. One of the best movies of the year that I've seen so far. 
visually stunning, like one of the best movies that I've seen. Also, like as far as visually looking, it's gonna be a hard one to beat. You already know my score. Of course, before that, don't forget to give this video a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time I post something new. This weekend, um, I do plan on watching um, The Jungle Cruise, so that review should be coming up tomorrow on Saturday. And hopefully, I can go see Stillwater and... I'm gonna maybe try to do a double feature tomorrow so hopefully we can have those up for the weekend and I may or may not have my June tier list up not June July tier list up this week I think I may wait till next week to have that up because I do still want to watch old I haven't seen that one quite yet um, so again don't forget to hit that bell so you don't miss a beat so the Green Knight like I said before Great performances, great to look at, great direction. It's a wonderful movie, one of my favorite movies of the year. Absolutely stunning to look at. Oh, we got Ghost in here too, you guys. If, if you like, like King Arthur, The Round Table, stuff like that. It's nothing like that. <laughs> Just know that those things are, are referenced here. So with all that said, I'm going to give The Green Knight a large popcorn this movie's fantastic in my own personal opinion i was totally totally here for it if you have seen the green knight let me know down below what did you think about it did you like it did you love it did you hate it was it just not for you are you planning on checking it out is it something that just doesn't seem interesting to you totally understand like i said it's not going to be for everybody all right guys until next time i'll see you guys at concessions bye